Mini Wargamer Dave here from MiniWarGaming.com. Tonight is a very special night because we are having a fully decked out tank monstrous creature battle. And I'm going to show you who is playing and the pieces that we are using in this battle. So let's uh, start out with the predators that we have here. Yes, you see five of them. You only see two princes there, but one more is coming out. Two dreadnoughts, a bloodthirster. And let's take a look at Tim's. Two land raiders, one bane blade. Okay, this is Team Chaos. And Joe. All right, let's take a look at the opposing team. We have a monolith, a whole whack of Carnifex eye. High Tyrant, Wing High Tyrant, Night Ringer. Yeah, he's that too. Yes, that is a converted Trigon. Another monolith? Another monolith. Another monolith. What's that Chaos tank doing on this side? Yeah, Nurgle. They're just rebellious against Chaos, which doesn't make sense. And we have this Tau piece of uh, fast attack skimmer that's going to be destroyed really quickly. Let's turn it but you know these things when you're firm and is it our turn to place, or what are we doing? You guys play first? Hey, all yours. Okay, end of the first round. Shoot again. First round. Okay. As you can see, everything moved up. Land Raiders moved up. They're all full 12 inches. Same with my Predator. My Prince. He ran. Remember, this is 5th edition rules. Everything fired on the Trigon. Everything that was humanly possible in the Warhammer universe fired on the Trigon and did not kill it. Not yet. It has two wounds left. Hold on, he's not going to survive, which is kind of a shame. That just means that these guys are... Yeah, they're kind of tank killers as, as well. Yeah, but he's like an ultra tank killer. Five attacks, gargantuan creature. Yeah, his bird mother thinks he's cool. That's at least like a two plus. <laughs> this is the moment of truth. We are firing our last cannons on our predators at the monolith. And we're going to kill it in one shot. Three shots. <laughs> in, in three shots. Yes, that's right. I have my consigliere over here. I'm not sure that's a word. <laughs> no, it's Italian. Oh, or, um, Italian Mafia Counselor. Yeah. Twin Link. He's been hit. On what? what you the monolith. Penetrate! Penetrating! Two penetrating hits. Oh, okay. Five. Weapon destroyed. It's done. First. Yeah, I hate my life too. Yeah. Now do I shut it off? Now do you shut it off? Oh, we gotta shut off more than that. <laughs> The monstrous creatures overran us. We're obviously kidding. We slaughtered with our tanks. This is what happened. Exactly. All the tanks are left. That's what happened. And they just surrendered because... Oh, your, your dreadnought's dead, Dave. Remember what? your dreadnought died? It died. Oh, yeah, that's right. They, uh... Again. They really, really killed my... They killed my dreadnought twice. That's what happened. And your demon prince died really yeah. too. Sure. Okay, let's look at their casualties now. Their casualties include a hive tyrant, three carnifex eye, the trigon, a monolith, the night singer, no, the night bringer. I didn't like that one. This thing was left on the board and could not shoot. Shame on you for going on the other side, chaos. For all you people saying that, oh, you know, you had this on the board, you weren't supposed to have this on the board because that's against the rules, you're only allowed this amount. It was obviously just a fun game, so don't take it too seriously. Well, we take it seriously because Warhammer is our life. See, they're still talking about it. Is Warhammer our life? It's our life. See? Exciting life. This guy's a fireman. Yeah. He's, he's putting out fire, he's like, oh, cool, they hate me too. No, no, yeah. I'm just kidding. It's true. Don't do drugs. And let's take a look at the shirt, just for a second here. The, the, no. <laughs> I'm going to do a little experiment here. It's going to work, okay? The camera has, like, an invisible little spike that comes out, and people move away from it when it, like, shoots. See? See, look, see? It just happened. You were just witnesses of that. Yep, this is a typical day at the Warhammer Club. Typical night, Wednesday night. James Bond face. <laughs> hey, I like the crap that you say, because the crap that you say is funny crap. <laughs> and so he says nothing. And we have rodents. No, we really don't. That's just kind of funny and random. Is this our staff member? The newest staff member. This is a pretty happening room. Is this like the painting room or the runaway from the camera room? Is there anyone here that doesn't want to be on camera? Okay, then I won't point over there. I won't point to your face. You don't mind, do you? Not that close. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'll get out of here now. I shall leave. What are you doing in the corner by yourself? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, no, I'm just walking around. I'm just teasing. Fireman Tim is our veteran terrain builder. This is his latest masterpiece. All right. Let's take the plague bearers out of here. 
so we can focus on what really matters. The dead, sliced up, carcass spewing zombies that are trying to get out of the pool of toxic acid. I really don't know why these guys are lying down. I mean, they lie down for no one. Why are you napping? Oh, these guys have the right idea. You pull a random person off the street and you bring them in here and you just join random conversations and they will think to themselves, what world am I living in? A box of Terminators. That's what the king just said. He said a box of Terminators. But other people wouldn't know what that means, okay? But we know what that means. We all know what a box of Terminators is. How do you feel about your new Terminators? I feel good. They're going to win me the tournament, so I'm feeling good about that. Okay. That's a good thing to feel good about. Of course, you're going to lose me the tournament. Who's going to lose? Bad. The Terminators. Really? Why? If I say they're going to lose and they win, then I exceed my expectations. So it's like you win both ways. If you say you lose and you lose, you're right. Exactly. If you say you lose and you win, you're more right.